container detected. Inhibitor container nearby.
These PK propaganda posters make me sick. Die! 
this motherfucker. <laughs> Baby Blues, I thought he'd start crying like a toddler. Meh. 
didn't tell me anything I didn't already know. Francis sent him. No offense, boss, but your brother's not right. <laughs> no shit, Sherlock. He's been waiting for years to make his move. We'll get him, and whatever's left of his group soon enough. Ain't no one left. We killed them all. Ah, Avery. Just the man I came to see. Ah, another of Francis's goons. Been here long? Long enough to know that you tortured a kid to death. He attacked me, you know. Never saw the kid before today. And the torture? Well, just a hobby of mine. His fault for provoking me. Well, shit. Francis told the truth about you, at least. You invaded their territory and Fitz only came to talk, so what happened? Francis, probably. Cause truth be told, I was willing to talk. I sent a man with a map to propose a reasonable division of the territory. Next thing I know, this crazy kid shows up at my doorstep. My brother got into the kid's head. It's what he does. Your brother's dead. Then you saved me a ton of effort. Here, take this for your troubles. Now get the fuck out of here. And deliver a message for me. Tell Daisy and Paul that this is my turf now. All of it. All of it. That's a shitty deal. No way. Have it. Grab him! Into the rub! You pilgrim! God, these brothers. The world's a better place without them. I'd better check that body. Eye of Horus. Shit. This must be Fetz. It looks like an agonizing death. I'd better give the news to Paul and Daisy at Frank's place. your every need.
looking forward to our next rodeo. Why don't you fuck off with your blue friends? <laughs> Sweet weapon you got there, Aiden. Is it new? Did Daisy make it back? I don't see her. She did. She's resting. Uh, where's Fitz? He... He's dead. Francis conned him. He and your team were duped into attacking Avery. No, wait, what? Fitz? Th th that doesn't make any sense. It's, it's not like him. Francis used Fitz's love for his mother and the fact that she'd been injured to fire him up. And then Avery caught him and tortured him to death. Poor stupid kid. Getting himself killed just because he loved his mother. Fucking bullshit. All right. Okay. And what about the rest of the team? Marta, Snarry, Mehmet, are they gone too? I did run across some corpses that didn't appear to be Francis or Avery's men, so... Chances are that was them. I'm so sorry. Well, at least tell me that Francis and Avery are dead. You got him, didn't you? Yeah, I took care of both of them. They won't be a threat to you anymore. All those people dead. <laughs> we never wanted to fight. What a fucking mess. What the hell do I do now? You comfort Daisy. You mourn your friends. Then... You carry on with life. Here's the reward I promised. Someone had to get something good out of this. Might as well be you. I have to tell Daisy about Fitz now. Not a conversation I want to have. But I gotta pull the bandage off. Quick. And at least her son's murderers are dead. And that's what they call cold comfort. <laughs> well, it'll have to do. Fuck. Thank you, Aiden. These PK propaganda posters make me sick. Come on, tell me. She's still seeing. Juan and Frank make quite the pair, an alcoholic and a junkie. <laughs> Thank <laughs> you.
Something funky's going on. Get in the way! <laughs> 